now let's trim and there now since I'm going to draw the draw next the horns of the object I'll have to find out how long is the horn so you can see here 13 that means if the radius of this circle is 25 the length of the line from this tip to the center is 13 plus 25 that's 38 so I can draw a line from here upward that's 38 all right now I will rotate this one okay at 30 degrees and then I can offset this with a distance of so what's the width of this 1.5 since this is 1.5 I can offset this line by 0.75 so click offset and the distance is 0.75 okay now I will connect this two then I can erase the middle and then trim these things and these two and also this now as you can see here okay the radius of this horn the fillet of the horn is 0 0.6 that means I need to fillet this by the radius of 0.6 so here to here and then another fillet okay now I have done the first horn so I don't want to repeat the same process what I will do next is just mirror this object so mirror enter and then enter so I'll trim this one so I'm done with the horn what we'll do next are the eyes now the eyes the distance of the eyes from the center is 11 and its distance from the bottom is 14 so that means if I draw a line from here and offset it by 11 I can have the first indication then I'll do another offset which is which has a distance of 14 and then draw a circle so you can see here 5 so that means the radius is 2.5 now it's easier now I'll just mirror this one okay so the rest of the indicators I can erase now we're done with the head so what are we going to do next for me I will draw this next this one the rectangle the rectangle can be drawn by offsetting this one and then proceeding with the dimension the distance of the offset is 3.8 so I'll offset by 3.8 okay and then you have a length of 46 46 okay this one is 50 that means I can close this all right the figure almost look the same now now as we can see here the distance the center of this circle from here to here is 12.75 that means if I draw a line okay before I'll draw a line I'll just I'll analyze first this is 46 so from here to here that's 46 plus 11 that means 57 now if you look at the figure this is a circle with a diameter of 12.5 that means this is 6.25 so I can draw a line from here so here 57 enter now this 57 I can offset this by 
75. This is 12 points. Then the distance between the other one is 30.8, so that means I can copy this. Okay, any base point, so that's 30. 